The name, Chromecast Eternal. The game, Hogwarts Legacy. Yes. It's times like this when I think, am I going to cut this out? Or will I keep this in? <sighs> am I going insane? Oh, I forgot, we have Hippo of the Griff. Go! Yes. Oh my god. I love... Actually, is this faster than a broom? No, it's about the same speed, I'd okay. say. What do we have to do? We have abortion. No, we don't. We have... Um... <laughs> we have astronomy class. <laughs> um... I want to fly around for a bit. I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Am I gonna learn about my astrology sign or something? Ladies, Professor Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Okay. Is the observation deck where Dumbledore died? Yes, it is. Still don't have your own? You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share. With Mr. Takar. Were you not a Slytherin Here, student I can a second adjust ago? That for no, no, bring it into focus on your own. Were you not a Slytherin student a second ago? Oh, hello. Ooh. Wow, that's. Wow. I, s I see the stars. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very selfsame stars above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Hello. 
I don't believe we've met officially. I'm Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. Thank you. Uh, how kind. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. No, I have It's not. only oh. the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first-rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I... Uh, thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some, uh... Reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Okay. Where are we venturing to? Okay, as long as I could. Chest. Thank this you. was his old telescope. Thank you. I don't have to talk to you. Goodbye. The perfect Hello. night for. I have the telescope. It's nicer than I'd expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is um something else. Yes. What is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. And you'd like help finding it? So the telescope came with a catch. And you'd like help finding it? you need someone to help find it? I do. Are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. Sounds exciting. I mean, I suppose I could join you. Why not? No need to convince me. Let's get going. Brilliant. You won't regret it. Shall we? Yes. Hold up. Zoom. Oh, my God. As soon as you've lined Rotate. up the telescope, oh we will be able to fill out our star chart. I did it. How the hell did you get that from just a couple of dots? I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. I look forward to that. Thank you, Amit. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest, all beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Um, anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. Okay. Bye. I can't, I have to be on the ground with you, don't I? Yes. That was just like, I don't get reasonable. The beans. The beans. <laughs> Their aptitude for magic is beyond anything I've ever seen. Hello. There you are. Yes. I've received your owl. I was able to speak with Lord Gok, the goblin I mentioned before. Well, what did you learn? He and Ranrock were close once, but they had a falling out. You believe he can be trusted? Difficult to say. He seemed trustworthy. Difficult to know, really. But Sorona Ryan trusts him. 
Well, that's something, I suppose. Supposing he can be trusted, will he help us get to Ranrock? I retrieved a stolen helm. He hopes to return to Ranrock in order to regain his confidence. You have been busy. Let's hope your efforts result in our learning something about Ranrock's plans. Lord Gok did mention that Ranrock is searching for something, but he couldn't say what. Perhaps that helm will yield some answers. Ranrock is searching for something? I feared as much. I've heard an unusual amount of activity. Goblins and wizards, I surmise. When visiting my portrait at my castle. Rookwood Castle? My former residence, yes. That castle is also the location of your next trial. Okay. I have some bad news. I'm sorry to tell you that Victor Rookwood, evidently your descendant, is a dark wizard in league with Ranrock. My descendant? A dark wizard? I'm afraid we've no time to waste. Despite the obstacles that clearly await you, you must get to Rookwood Castle immediately. Not only is it the location of the next trial, it is home to a source of power that would be devastating in the wrong hands. I do wish we had the luxury of time. However, I do not doubt your abilities. Find my portrait there as soon as you can. Very well, sir. I'm on my way. Best of luck. Let us go to Rookwood Castle. No time to waste. I'll meet you at Rookwood Castle. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I very much like my first draw. How's it going? Chabuka! What's going on here? Professor Rookwood was right. The place is crawling with Victor Rookwood's lot and Ranrock's loyalists. They're working together all right, but it is not a friendly alliance. I'm sure you'll agree that we need to find a way in other than the front gate. Let's go. Okay. The pulse, well then. Where shall we go? Where are we going? Oh. You can't stop Red Rats Rebellion! Was this supposed to happen? You're really not very good at this, are ya? Yes, I don't know if this was supposed to happen. At all. Oh, that's new. Come on, Professor Fig. Come on. Come on now, Big Daddy. Or not. Sure, why not? If I'd known your plan was to dig up half the country... I wouldn't have to dig if you could simply manage to bring me the child. We wouldn't need the child if you hadn't sent a dragon to retrieve the container. I spent months and countless ministry favors tracking. You let them board the carriage. My options were limited once I knew it would be inconveniently beyond my reach of that infernal school. Have you not acquired enough power here? I allowed you to tunnel under my family home. Allowed me? You are here only because you are descended from a keeper and may at some point inadvertently become valuable. We had an agreement. I will share with you the power that I discovered if you locate the stores of magic that are yet to be found. So, unless you want another demonstration of my power, a power that you one day hope to wield, bring me the child. digging for stores of magic. And Ranrock knows about the Keepers. Yes, I caught that too. Professor Rookwood said that you'd understand more once you complete the next trial. Let's get into that castle. Yes, let's do that thing. 
Where is Ranrock is my question. Oh god, what did I just hear? Oh. Any special words you want me to pass on to your mum? I don't actually know if my mum is alive in this universe. where they lead. It looks yes. empty. If they've taken all of it, why are they still here? Ranrock said there's more to bring them. And if he's right about that, the false or may not be located here. Wherever it is, we need to find it before they do. Where is that portrait? The goblins and dark wizards who've overrun your castle are digging for stores of magic and have broken open some sort of container. No. Things are more dire than I could have imagined. If, as you told Percival, a goblin in his vault was wielding a powerful magic, then they have somehow learned. It cannot be. And, sir, they know you were a keeper. Ranrock used the term. This makes no sense. How did... We shall discuss this later. Right now, you must complete the next trial. I'm ready. Just tell me where I need to go. The power you stand to wield must first be fully understood. The trials will ensure that. Power without knowledge is dangerous indeed. In the wrong hands, we will simply have to outwit Ranrock. And my unfortunate namesake. Very well, Professor. Tell me where I need to go. I shall reveal the path. Professor Fig must leave you now. Okay. Where are you? There you are. Where are you? There you are. Okay then. And bye. I shall await your arrival in the map. Okay, bye. 
Okay. Do I go up here? I guess I do. Let's go up here. There's something near. Let's go over here. I found some ancient magic. Oh, it's a big boy again. Okay. I got this. I'm curious to hear of Isidore's travels. Do you come in? Please, have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father. These are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Sedora. What have you done? I took his pain. Oh dear. This is uncharted magic, Isadora. You can only see what has been sealed in the jar, and we do not know what power that may hold. But the traces of that magic are different from what I've seen before. Thank you. Interesting. 
interesting. Can I move, please? Hello. Oh, can I can I move? Thank you. You're back. I'm back. One piece, no less. How do I speak? I need to come up real close to you. Right. It is good to see you again. You too, Broski. Professor Rookwood told me about what happened at Rookwood Castle. In light of the dire circumstances in which we find ourselves, it is most fortunate that someone so competent is following this path. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep the second artifact safe as you Be. advised. Good. Are you ready to move on? Bones. I'm ready. Wait. Bones. Yeah. What was Bones. the glowing strand that Isidore found from her father's chest? <laughs> Pain. You will understand more about her actions as you complete the trials. I'm ready. I'm ready for whatever comes next. In the <laughs> Introductions are in order. A third person. Allow me to introduce former Hogwarts headmistress, Neve Fitzgerald. Ah, uh, yes. Hello, Nia. Um... How do you do? I must say that I was not entirely surprised to learn that a student had been completing the trials. I've always believed Hogwarts students capable of anything they set their minds to. Thank you, Professor. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. I am certain that you are more than capable of completing my trial. However, I must first, how shall I say, prepare the location of your next trial. We trust your judgment, Professor Fitzgerald. You should know better than anyone how to manage the inconvenience of, well... A vainglorious and exasperating headmaster? Indeed I should. I shall confirm that everything is in order immediately. Of course. Professor Fitzgerald needs some time to clear the way forward. Until then, you should continue to hone your magic. If you learn more about Ranrock and Victor Rookwood's activities in the meantime, please let us know. Very well, Professor. Okay. I know, I know. Continue to hone my magic. You do learn quickly. Hopefully you will soon hear from Lodgok as well. And we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon. Wait. I never said anything about the helmet. It's Christmas time. Da 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 Alright. Well, thank you so much for watching, everyone. I'll see yes. you in the next... Oh, God. Okay. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I'll see you in the next episode um, of Hogwarts Legatory. Legacy. Chingy Bungus. Bye! Bye.